This is Social Confidential, where Adweek's social media editors take a look behind the logo to find out who's tweeting and sharing for major brands. I'm Jessa Ferris, and I'm here with Pearl Gable and Megan Coyne, who have made national headlines for the fun and irreverent way they run the official Twitter accounts for the New Jersey state government and Governor Phil Murphy. How do you find the right balance between your signature humor and keeping the public informed about various serious topics? The governor is really funny. He's got this dad humor. It's something that just resonates with us. It's emotion that will get this information across. And, and humor is an emotion. I don't think that there's like a ratio we have of like, you know, one serious post to one funny post. I think that what resonates best with people is when we kind of do our, our weird or funny posts. I think that that's what sticks with you more rather than just a you know, a boring, kind of straightforward, informative post. So you would say that Governor Murphy's leadership style reflects the tone that you've crafted for these accounts? We didn't come up with knucklehead. The governor used the word knucklehead because that knucklehead is a good word to use. And so we we hopped on that. Tell me a little bit about the COVID distance series with Snooki and Springsteen and other public figures. We have these messages, very simple messages. How do you get it out? We kept talking about staying six feet apart and the governor is like six foot three. So I was like, oh, you know, it'd be funny if we used him as a form of measurement, right? So that was our first one. And then Pearl was like, let's just keep doing it with, you know, all these other things. And so then it was just like different Jersey icons. And then it moved to like food and animals. We're not sitting on a treasure trove of COVID-19 measurements. We do it, we drop it. I mean, that's it. What's your philosophy when dealing with trolls? The haters are always gonna be mad and that's okay. We embrace it, they don't bring us down. New Jersey has a history of being kind of bullied. It's the armpit of America. It's not really a state. We get trolls against New Jersey for sure. Surprisingly, now that Megan and I have been like written about, we get trolls against ourselves. I think running that, the New Jersey account, like standing up for Jersey so much has made me a lot bolder and a lot more empowered with my own trolls as well. Aside from the ones we've discussed, what's a recent tweet that you're particularly proud of? Better to be six feet apart than six feet under. And that was, that was all him. The governor was doing his daily briefing and I was listening and he, he just came out with that out of nowhere. Better to be six feet apart than six feet under. That just had to go up on his Twitter. If you had one piece of advice for other social media managers, what would it be? Keep it real, but also I think to, to take a break. Believe in yourself, keep it strong, build trust with, with those around you and just follow your heart and your gut. Do you have any other final takeaways? Wherever you are in the world, harness that Jersey energy. This has been amazing. I'm, I, I was already a big fan and now I'm a bigger fan. I'm Jessica Ferris. See you next time on Adweek Social Confidential.